I'm Dr. Christy Preddy Franzak, and I recently held and facilitated a webinar called When Play is More Than Just Playing, Delivering Intentional Instructional Through Daily Activities. And we went so quickly through all of the resources, I thought it might be helpful just to break down all the different tips, tools, ideas that you can put into practice immediately. So this is sort of a post-webinar summary of the key resources. And this was a webinar that was sponsored by the Family Development Military Families Learning Network. And so you can get everything at the URL that you can see on your screen. If you're listening, you're going to want to take a minute and write down the following URL. At the URL, you'll find the recording to the whole full webinar. And then if you scroll clear to the bottom of the page, you will see links to the slides that were shared during the webinar, as well as a reference list of all all the resources mentioned during the webinar, including those that I'm going to walk through in this quick video. So you're going to want to go to learn.extension.org forward slash events forward slash 2942. So learn.extension.org forward slash events forward slash 2942. And again, you can get the full recording. And if you scroll clear to the bottom of the page of that URL, you'll find links to all of the resources and references that I'm going to talk about in this quick video overview or summary. So the first thing we talked about was that it's mindset before method. So we gave several tips and tools, resources, strategies, whatever you want to call them, practical things you can put into your life and work immediately were things that got to a change in our mindset. So the change in mindset was really about our beliefs around the power of play. So one of the links that you'll find, again, if you go clear the bottom of that landing page and click on the references resources for this particular webinar, you'll get a link to the power of play infographic. Many of the things that I'll mention are also found on my website, which is preKteachandplay.com, and you can go to forward slash shop, and most everything in there is free, including this Power of Play infographic. And so infographics have a really nice way of sharing complex information in a lighter way, an easier way, and a visual way. So if you need to help others change their mindset about the power of play, you might want to share the infographic. The other thing we shared was our ebook that is full of inspirational quotes and facts and figures that really speak to the power of play in early development and learning. And this is an ebook that you can download, share, uh, print off different quotes to kind of keep yourself motivated and keep believing or what I call Peter Pan believing in the power of play. So you'll want to check out the infographic and the ebook. We also gave two things to help guide or aid in self-reflection because much of the change in practice or change in our mindset starts with our ability to reflect on what we're currently doing and what we might, might want to do differently. And this particular resource is a framework for engaging in meaningful self-reflection that was developed by my colleague, Laura Fish. And it's a step-by-step -step process to really help people, either individuals or if you're a coach or a consultant or if you're helping other adults think about their own beliefs and practices, you could also use this framework to guide your discussions if you're supporting other adult learners. So you want to be sure to check out and download this framework for engaging in meaningful self-reflection. And then my colleague Myra Parata and I developed these things we call mindful inquiries. And they're just a fun way that you get a different card each time you open up the document that's also a digital file that you can just swipe through and find something that motivates you or interests you or gives you a reflection prompt. And so as we engage in sort of this mindset before method, one of the things you can use the mindful inquiries is to really think about what you um, are doing as kind of an advocate, uh, a champion, if you will, of play. And so one of the things is that we ourselves have to play. So you want to think about what do I do on a daily basis that can be fun and that I can then model the importance of play in development and learning. 
Then we got quickly into some methods, and the primary method for making sure that we were intentionally teaching during play was the use of embedded learning opportunities. And the way we supported that was this idea that there are five pieces and parts to delivering an embedded learning opportunity, or an ELO, and that's knowing what we're going to teach, when, where, with what, and how. And the teach, that word, is just meant to build children's brains, to promote development and learning. Not that we all have to be formally called a teacher. It's just this idea that as an adult, we're there to support young children's development and learning by building their brains. And so we start with, do we know what we're going to teach? Then we think about when, where, with what, and how. And we specifically gave three examples. Again, you can download each of these three on the resources list for the webinar. One is for the story Soul Friends, one is for the Very Hungry Caterpillar, and one is for the elephant who tried to tiptoe. And for each of these stories, we targeted a different what. We described the when and the where would be, of course, a time and place where we're reading the story, the materials, just the book, and then the how were different evidence-based strategies to then teach the outcome that we had targeted first and foremost. So there are three specific examples of embedded learning opportunities for these three great stories that you can download as well. And then we gave access to um, how to download a educational app that we call a Power Pack. And so you can download that from the App Store or from Google Play. You can get the link, of course, on that resources handout for webinar number three, but it's also at preKteachandplay.com forward slash power packs. It's one word and it's plural. So preKteachandplay.com forward slash power packs. And you can download this free educational app through the App Store or through Google Play. And it's divided into four categories which represent the win portion of a day. There are three levels, so this sort of speaks to the what because it's a degree of complexity of what we're teaching, though the broad thing is self-regulation, but it's also at really early self-regulation as children you know, enter into preschool and then late preschool, early elementary. And then the how are the three evidence-based strategies that we use throughout the educational app. And so it's just this basic little slide that pops up in the app that gives you a prompt of what to say or do that will intentionally create an embedded learning opportunity to teach self-regulation during everyday routines, everyday events, including play. And so if you are like many of us and have just too much screen time, then you can also download kind of a little starter pack of the educational app. So these are still the power packs. It's still teaching self-regulation, but at preKteachandplay.com forward slash podcast seven, you can learn more at by reading or the transcript or listening to the actual podcast, or you can request the download where you can get 20 or 25 of these printable sheets that have the prompt of how to embed self-regulation across the daily routine, including through play. And so those were all the things that we shared um, in our webinar on the importance and the power of play. The first several are really designed to shift and support your mindset that play is the critical way in which all children and really across the lifespan, the way that we learn and develop. And then we talked about how do we create embedded learning opportunities, specifically how do we think of these five components and then how can we do that when we're reading, when we're at the grocery store, when we're in line for anything, while we're at circle time, out on the playground, it doesn't matter. There's always an opportunity to embed through play. Mm -hmm.